The Rangers head into the weekend. First place up by two games against Houston. We just finished a road trip. Well, a series, a road series in Houston. And now we've flown across the nation all the way to the beautiful San Diego to take on the talented but underachieving Padres. Let's talk about the series right now. Hey, my name is Jeff Bates. This is the Texas Clubhouse. We talk a lot about Rangers here. We talk about baseball here and we talk about stuff that drives me crazy, like a road trip to Houston and to San Diego. Look, at if you watched my preview video, thanks for watching, and if you did, you know that I was pessimistic. Going down to Houston, going across the nation to San Diego, I didn't like our pitching matchups at all, at all. I predicted a two and four road trip. I very much hoped then and hope now. I'm, I was wrong. We lose the first two games ugly. Could have won both, but didn't lost both of the first two games in Houston. Then we get down early 3-0 in Houston. Freaking Alex Bregman with a bomb gives us a 3-0 lead. And it's looking like sweep town. And then, boy, did we put the beat down on the whiners down in Houston. I make no bones about my hatred for the Astros. I hate them. Unapologetically hate them them. I'm a Dodgers fan and a Rangers fan. I grew up in Southern California. My grandma was a Dodgers fan. I've been a Dodgers fan my whole life. Moved out to DFW over a decade ago. Season ticket holder for the Rangers. I love my Rangers. My personal baseball fantasy would be the Dodgers and the Rangers in the World Series. So obviously as a Dodgers fan, I hate the Astros. Astros. Obviously as a Rangers fan, I hate the Astros. From You know the story. Fromber Hits Marcus after Alvarez gets hit by Haney. Yes, clearly, certainly not on purpose. Simeon doesn't like it. Boom, goes deep, talks to Martin Malnano, who hasn't hit over 200 since, you know, I was in high school. Shut your freaking trap, Martin Maldonado. Listen, from what Marcus said, he said, we're going to beat you. And then he said the next time, I told you. To which Martin said, yeah, just like in Oakland. To which Marcus said after the fact, when I was in Oakland, Houston won the, the division twice and we, the A's, won it once. So what are you talking about, Malnano? You can, you're good at defense. Our catcher's better. And, and you suck at offense. Our catcher's better. And you yip, yip, yip. You know, I was happy to see him shut him up. When Odalis goes deep with the Grand Slam to get it to 13 and blow it away, he's not taking his time around the bases, but he's not in a hurry. He gets to third, and if you watch the video, you see Bregman running home. Gets to home, I think, before Adalas does, because Simeon and Martin are having a conversation. You know what? I like it. I think the Rangers put their name down on the map. You know, the Cowboys are America's team. Maybe the Rangers can be the America's team. Everybody hates, everybody hates the Astros, and maybe your team's about to go leave the, you know, they're about to trade off there. Maybe you're a White Sox fan and they're trading off all their stars. Or maybe you're a Cubs fan and they're about to trade off all their stars. Must stink to live in Chicago. All of that aside, jump on the bandwagon. The Rangers can be America's team. We will take a swipe at the Astros for you now. Today, just about an hour and a half ago as I'm filming this, uh, Joe Kelly, one of my personal favorite human beings, and uh, Lance Lynn, former Ranger, got traded from the White Sox to the Dodgers. Now, I like that because Joe Kelly should be a Dodger. I love that. Throw out that lip at Carlos Correa. I know Correa's not there anymore. I get it, but I still, Altuve's still there. Bregman's still there, and I still hate them. I will always hate them. They stole the World Series. I hate them, and, and they whine about it, and they chip about it, and I don't like them. So all of this to say, are the Rangers America's team? I say yes. Why not? Let's do it. But anyway, Lance Lynn, Joe Kelly are now in L.A. I thought the Rangers might be looking at both of them. Now I might do a video about the trade deadline. I should probably do it if I'm going to do it. I should probably stop talking about it and do it. But those are two chips that I was hoping we would get. I thought we might get Lance Lynn back. His numbers aren't great this year, but, it, you know, he strikes out a lot of people, a lot of swing and miss. And I like Joe Kelly a lot, and he brings an edge and all those things. But I still think there's trades to be had there. Another starting pitcher, another arm in the pen wouldn't hurt the Rangers at all. But for now, we got a weekend series in San Diego. We should talk about the pitching matchups because... I'm a little worried. Tonight, Friday night, we got Dane Dunning, 8-3, versus Joe Musgrove, 9-3. Musgrove of the no-hitter last year. Was it last year? I don't know. Joe Musgrove of the only Padres no-hitter ever. 
He's good. Dane Dunning's good. Coming off not his best start ever. This is a good pitching matchup, and that's the problem. These are all good pitching matchups. The Rangers have good arms. Okay, the Padres are throwing out good arms three nights in a row against us here in San Diego. So after the big series, after the emotion, after the flight to San Diego, we've got three important games. Again, I said I predicted a two and four road trip. I hope we go three and three. I hope we just come back from the road trip in first place. That's what I said in the previous video. And that's still where I stand. Can If we could win this series against the Padres, it's a 500 road trip. If we win one and lose two, it's exactly what I predicted two and four. Of course, I want more than that, but I just get, get me a series win here and a 500 road trip and I'll be excited, ecstatic, excited put it together and it's, it's been a, anyway I'm very excited about tonight's game it's a late game for us here in Texas I'll be watching and let's hope Dane can go deep then we have Saturday night a 740 start here in Texas what does that make 540 out there in San Diego interesting matchup Martin Perez who's been middling uh, he's been right on the edge of do I do we want him in the rotation in my opinion versus former Ranger great you Darvish um, Darvish hasn't had the great the greatest of his years, but they've got to be the favorite in this one on a Saturday night. Darvish versus Martin in San Diego, scary matchup that Saturday night, and it's hugely important that we get one of the first two because on Sunday, Blake Snell, who has been on fire, Snellzilla, they're calling him out there, fun guy, funny guy, on the trading block. Listen. I hope they sell, and I hope they sell before Sunday because I really don't want Snell to pitch against my Rangers on Sunday night. And who's our starter? Joe, everybody. TBD, the terrifying TBD. It's a bullpen game. We don't have somebody set up there. It's not Lance Lynn. He's in L.A. I don't know what's going to happen for the starter on Sunday, but Snellzilla is scheduled for the Padres. That's a scary one. They'll clearly be favored in that one. So we need to win one of the first two <coughs> or two of the first two um, big time because that game is going to be a tough one for us. So there, I'm worried about this series. I'm very much hopeful that we can win the series. Let me know. I feel very pessimistic lately. No Corey Seager for a while. Don't love that. We need a piece or two or three. Trade deadlines, what, Tuesday? We'll be talking about that through the rest of the weekend. Let me know. Are you excited about this series? I, I'll be real. I just want this series to be over. I want them to come home. Oh, we got the White Sox when we come home. I think it's the White Sox. We'll talk about that when we get here. Let's get through San Diego and the Padres. They haven't been playing well all year, but they're certainly a good roster, and I hate the matchups this weekend, and I'm feeling very negative. What say you? Let me know in the comments. Maybe I'm just a negative Nancy. I don't know. Thanks for watching. Have the best day ever. Blah, 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 blah. Go Rangers. Prove me wrong. Sweep the Padres into the ocean. See you next time. Bye for now.